bust out the umbrellas. The visiting Esperanza Aztecs take on the El Dorado Golden Hawks. Esperanza's Mitchell Mosman finds his deep down a run in the second until he changes things with a shot up the middle. The relay is mishandled, allowing Mitch Christensen to score the tying run. Aztecs up 4-2 in the fourth and check out third baseman Kevin Veers. A diving stop and he nails the runner at first. El Dorado's big catcher Trevor Velez brings his team closer with an RBI single here in the fifth and momentum is on the Golden Hawks side as starting pitcher Kyle Toomey gets a strikeout. And with two outs in the sixth, Dylan Moore ties the game with a hit to right. He's followed by Chris Rivera who gives the Golden Hawks the lead 5-4 but Moore is thrown out to end the inning. However, nobody tells Esperanza it's closing time. Veers hits one to deep right. He cashes in Brandon Morones to tie the game. But they're not done yet. Ryan McCall knocks in the go-ahead run to take the lead 6-5. And get over here! Chris Connors with the comebacker and the win. Well, we're playing real well. and We started playing well last week. But of course, you saw how this game went. And uh, if the game would have gone another inning, then who knows who would have won. I think we're progressing more and more each day at practices, and we're getting better, and we're coming more close as a team. And you can see it on the field. We're gelling more, and we're making all our plays and not making any mental mistakes. Just having a good time playing. We're really coming together as a team, and every day, every win, we're really the team bonds a lot more and really getting stronger and stronger, so hopefully keep winning. Our guys battled today, but the bottom line in the end, one team wanted to win more than the other. And, uh, you know, we got out coached, we got out played, we got out hit, we got out pitched, we got out class. So uh, the bottom line is uh, we didn't come ready to play baseball this week. This was an exciting game that went down to the final at bat. It's no wonder that Esperanza head coach Mike Curran said that this is what Esperanza and El Dorado baseball used to be. And it's back in full force. Reporting from Placentia, I'm Jonathan Camus for OCVarsity.com.